What's up, Brit? Once again, I am Nev from Nev's Tech, but today we're going to talk a little bit about Revo Uninstaller. Now, most of us at one point or another will have a problem with programs that we simply can't uninstall for one reason or another. This can be a huge pain in the butt, and uh, it can be a real deal breaker. If you can't get that sucker off there, sometimes in the tech industry, you need to reformat the entire thing and re-image, which sucks. Anyways, with Revo Uninstaller uh, 2.0.3 is uh, the latest one. You can get this off Ninite.com and as soon as you start it up this is what you see all the programs that you have on your computer and AVG is giving me problems these days and AVG often has problems on installing so I'm just gonna go right through Revo and here I'm looking at uh, I got two AVG protections 132 bit 164 bit. I'm not sure what's going on there but I'm just going to eliminate these things one at a time so one thing you'll notice when you go to uninstall is, uh, once again, this is an advanced uninstaller. So, also when you uninstall, sometimes there's stuff left behind, system keys, things that really shouldn't be left behind. But with this, it will show you, uh, it'll show you everything within the system keys, within temporary files that get left behind, and it'll delete it for you outright. And before we uninstall anything, of course, it creates a system restore point. So here we can do a moderate, safe, or advanced. Now, sometimes when you rip system keys out, kicking and screaming like this, you'll mess with other things. I always go for moderate, and I never have a problem. So, of course, the first thing it does is it'll uninstall the program the way the program was meant to be uninstalled. And then when that doesn't work, you can go right to the, uh, the system key ripper outer. Okay, so right here we can see the issue that I'm running into. I can't uninstall it because something might have gone wrong. So, nuts to that action. And now we will start the scan. Of course, I'm using moderate. That's usually exactly what you need. The more, the closer to advanced you get, the more likely you get to screw something else up. But uh, for the most part, all the system keys for AVG should be within AVG stuff. <sighs> Alright, so right here we can see all the system keys. You might want to take a browse through there, see if there's anything you don't want to remove. Also files. Scroll up to the top. We're just going to get the nail on the head right there. And delete. Yes, we want to delete all of these. Alright, now these are the programs. Take a quick look just in case. AVG looks like all AVG, so select all, delete. Alright, so here, of course, it says we got to do a reboot before all this stuff is done. And that's it. I'm going to clean up these other two, and then I'm going to reinstall. Actually, these other three, and then I'll reinstall, and uh, we should be good. We should be good. So that's how you can uninstall something kicking and screaming that doesn't want to leave. I've used this on hundreds and hundreds of things. The only thing it ever hasn't worked for was uh, Bitdefender and the Bitdefender antivirus I deleted it as well as I could and then I reinstalled over top and it was just fine so definitely check this out Revo on installer it's very good perfect tool for any tech arsenal I recommend you check it out and uh, so for me like subscribe all that stuff uh, Brit and remind your husband game times at 8 and have a good one